Hello guys, welcome back to Dapsy Media. So recently, Vladimir Putin has said he will discuss Xi Jinping's 12th point to settle, and I quote, the acute crisis in Ukraine during a highly anticipated visit to Moscow by the Chinese president, and I quote, we always open, um, we are always open for a negotiation process, Mr. Putin said as the leader called each other dear friend. China released a plan to end the war last month. It includes six Using hostiles and resuming peace talks. But on Friday, the US won the peace plan could be a stalling tactic. US Secretary to State Antony Blinken said the world should not be fooled by any tactical move by Russia, supported by China or any other country, to freeze the war on its own terms. And he added, calling for a ceasefire that does not include the removal of Russian force from Ukrainian territory would effectively be supporting the um, ratification of Russian conquest. China's plan did not um, specifically say that Russia must withdraw from Ukraine, which Ukraine was insisted as a precondition for any talks. Instead, it talked of respecting the sovereignty of all the countries, adding that all parties must stay rational and exercise restraints and gradually um, de-escalate the situation. The plan also condemned the usage of unilateral sanctions. Um, seen as veiled criticism of Ukraine's allies in the West. On Monday, a military brand gave Mr. Xi a warm welcome to Moscow. Mr. Putin hailed China for observing the principles of justice and pushing for an, um, an undivided security for every country. In return, Mr. C told Mr. Putin, under your strong leadership, Russia has made great strides um, in its prosper prosperous, um, a prosperous development. I'm confident that the Russian people will continue to give you their firm support. Before Mr. C arrival at Putin wrote in China's People Daily newspaper that the two nations will not be um, weakened by aggressive US policy. For more news, visit radio.dapsim.com. Have a nice day.